Hello guys, today I want to showcase and present to you a new package called Migrator. For those of you who would like to have visual representation of migrations and ability to view the content of migrations, migrate and fresh the database visually. So I've installed it locally and also at the end of this video I will run through how it works because it's based on Livewire so this will be also kind of a Livewire lesson as well. So how does it work? I've installed it on my local demo project based on Quick Admin Panel and I have some migrations. So when you install that package you have a special URL called slash migrator which is by default protected by auth. So when you publish the config you have middleware auth by default but you can change that to web for example to make it public but I wouldn't advise that actually. And another security measure is that it works only on local environment which is also good. So what do we have here? We have the list of migrations. You can click on any migration and it will show you the fields. Or for example, for users table, there are more parameters visible and stuff like that. And then you can also create the migration directly from here. So for example, create a no projects table, for example, and table name projects, which is a create action. And you add that migration. It is added automatically in the file system. The success message is here. Migration was created. It appears at the end of the list with absent batch and you can migrate that. And in your file system, in the project itself, it is added at the end of the migrations. So it's basically running PHP Artisan make migration under the hood for you just from visual representation. And if you want to migrate that, you click migrate and migration was migrated. Cool. Then you can also delete the migration and it will ask you whether to delete the table and migration or delete just the table. For example, let's do both and table was dropped. Also, you can fresh the database, but this is an interesting part when I did it. So I click fresh database. You want to fresh migrations and there are options fresh just the database or fresh and seed and I do have some seeders in my database which includes admin user for my case so when I clicked fresh and seed this is the log of fresh and seed and it works but if I choose fresh database without seeding I'm immediately logged out because the middleware is auth the admin user is not seeded so the database has been migrated but no seed if I refresh the table, no data in the users table, which means I'm logged out. So if you have any action on migrating users with seeds, be careful because you may not be able to log in afterwards. So this is how package works. It's actually pretty simple. Now let's take a look at the code. And in fact, this Laravel package is kind of like a mini project with its route and its migrations and its live wire components. So the routes are routes migrator, just one route get, a bit configurable if you want to do that. And then the whole main thing is about source, HTTP live wire migration, and there are three live wire components. Read, which is by default, the one that shows you the table, and there are a few more, create and save from what I remember. So if I zoom in a bit, there is a function migrate. The main function is render, which goes through migration directory and gets the files and shows it in the table. So migration dirs is another function that just checks the migration folders. And then whenever we call some action from the table, so there's a action fresh and all it does, all that package does actually for us is call the artisan commands. So we don't need the terminal in the best case scenario. If we don't need to fix anything, it just calls migrate fresh with arguments. And in the migrate method, it calls artisan migrate. And then also the interesting part is store message method, which is private, which just flashes the message on the screen and it uses library from what I remember it's toaster or sweet alert I don't remember actually let's check that out resources views live wire migration read blade it has alpine js as well it has another live wire components live wire component create is called inside of live wire component read blade and there's alpine x on clicked prevent so this repository could be kind of like a learning material for simple live wire on alpine js i recommend that so there's x show show migrate model which is alpine js and i don't see any libraries here so they're probably in the layout somewhere so live wire resources views layout and if we scroll down the layout is Oh yeah, this one. So it is sweet alert library after all. And this is how you call that from your layout blade and add event listener show message, 
corresponds to if we go back if we go back to the component itself in the migration create component we can find message like this dispatch browser event show message which will be caught by javascript and sweet alert so this is a simple package i'm not sure i would use that personally for visualizing the migrations i didn't ever feel the need for that i'm quite cool with terminal and php storm to edit all of that but you may consider that and tell me in the comments below whether you prefer such visual packages, small packages. I've seen something similar for routes, for visualizing routes and visualizing maybe your scheduled artisan commands and stuff like that. So this is the one for migration. I would personally use that as an example of a simple live wire and Alpine package, simple project to learn from. What do you think? And I have another way for you how to learn live wire if you're not familiar with that. On my courses, I have in the list this course, Practical Laravel Livewire from Scratch. It was released more than a year ago, but Livewire didn't change since then, except for small details. And also in January, I'm preparing a new course on Advanced Laravel Livewire. For those of you who are familiar with Livewire and simple things like wire model, but I'm going to take you much deeper. So if you want to get that course, and 25 other courses and all the courses a year ahead the best deal is to get a yearly membership for 99 dollars per year plus taxes if that applies to you by doing that you're supporting this youtube channel where i can make free videos and see you guys in those other videos